Hey guys, what is up? So for today, we'll be looking at the five times YouTubers trying to fight back with police officers. So yeah, go ahead, hit the like button, and if you haven't, hit the subscribe button also. Starting off with the first one, this was only a few days ago, and it is about Roman Atwood. Basically, Roman went to watch a basketball game in Cleveland, and while he was just sitting there, Roman immediately got pulled aside by some police officers there who were trying to protect the area. Now obviously, they thought he was going to streak the game like with Tali, but if you know Roman, he really doesn't do pranks anymore, he just focused on vlogging and his family. But still, the security guards were pretty aggressive toward him, and Roman did try to talk a lot back at them but I wouldn't say it was a huge fighting back because it was not and honestly in my opinion I think he handled the situation very nicely but for the next one here this one is coming from Vitaly ZDTV now obviously everyone knows Vitaly he's one of the craziest prankster on YouTube and he's been trying pretty hard upping his pranking game now his craziest one is when he climbed the D on the Hollywood sign his intention was to do a comeback because they didn't upload videos for his fans and really it was pretty epic for him to do that so when the police came they actually yelled at him telling Vitaly to come down or they will have to press criminal trespassing charges and Vitaly was like fuck that I'm gonna stay here as long as I want and fortunately after this I don't think Vitaly did go to jail but he did have to complete hundreds of hours of community service so all in all he made his fans happy and actually helped the community at the same time so for the third one on the list, this one is from FuzzyTube. Now the video itself is pretty old, but it has like 8 million hits on it. In the video, FuzzyTube had a pretty serious verbal fight with the police. Basically, he feels that he was wrongfully pulled over. The police pulled him over because he didn't have a license plate. And Fuzzy was pretty pissed because the reason that the car had no plate on was because it was a brand new car. But he did confirm that he has valid dealer plates, valid insurance, and valid registration. So he feels that the police just pulled him over because he had a hat on and driving a nice car. So I don't know, it's a pretty crazy story. If you haven't seen it, you can definitely go check it out after the video. But for the next one, one here this will be about the p prank video that roman and his friends pulled off about five years ago basically if you go watch the arrested edition they were resisting just about everything the police asked them to do i'm sure a lot of you have seen the video yourself roman wasn't the one who was doing the prank it was his friend dennis Rody. so after some heated conversation he ended up getting arrested and now for the final story this is probably the biggest one about youtubers having to deal with the police or the authorities and really man it took all the wildest pranks to combine to came up with something this crazy and this was the adm robbery prank the guys in the video are roman atwood with tally's ddtv dennis Brody and Chase Gilroy. This prank was shot like two months before it was even allowed to be on the internet because they had to deal with the legal issues. Yes, they did also have to go through court, but luckily they beat it. Roman Vitali and a bunch of his friends actually won the case against the Columbus police. So yeah, that's a pretty crazy one. And that's it for the video today, guys. Like the video if you enjoy it. Subscribe. Peace, and I'll catch you later.